Joyark is a cloud gaming platform that we classify as a pick up and play, own it, play it cloud gaming platform. This means you have to own the games on third party platforms like Steam, Ubisoft, Epic Games, and more. The catch with Joyark is that this is a mobile only platform. Phones and tablets are the only proper way to play on the platform. So, if you have an Android device, we'll go over how to get started with Joyark on Android devices. Now, before we begin, we're assuming your Joyark account is already active. Now, if you're looking to get set up with Joyark, check out our Getting Started video. Now, if you plan to play Joyark through the browser, Joyark does not want you to do that. It'll even tell you to download the app with the link. This will send you to the Google Play Store to download it or just go there directly. I have the link in the description to get the app directly from the Google Play Store. Click on the install button and start the install to your Android device. Let it run its course. Now be aware that you need to make sure that your Android is version 5.0 or better. Once the app is done downloading and installing, hit the open button to get started with the app. Once you have the app downloaded, log in with your Joyart credentials. Once you have logged in, you can now play the games you own on the platform if you have an active subscription or allotted playtime. Choose the game you want to play. In this case, I'm going to play Batman Arkham Origins. You can use the in-game touch controls, but I highly recommend using a Bluetooth gamepad or a mobile controller like a Razer Kishi for Android phones. Once your game is loaded, log into your respective account for that specific game you are playing. This one doesn't have one and will load right into the game. You can do this by using the touchscreen menu to get the keyboard up to enter your credentials. Once you are fully logged in, play the game as you would normally. Once finished, use the touchscreen menu again to exit the game and the session. Or, I highly recommend quitting the game properly so the game can cloud save for platforms like Steam. Now you can close your session and this will back you out to the Joyark site where you can choose another game to play or close Joyark altogether. If you like this getting started video of Joyark on Android, give us a like. Also, make sure to join as a member of the channel or join our Patreon in the links below. And above all else, make sure to subscribe to keep it locked right here at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.